In the last three months, I've been to Dubai, Davos, and Washington, D.C. Here's what's happening. Climate scientists say we need to be removing 10 billion tons of greenhouse gas every year by 2050. A new report from Rocky Mountain Institute says that to be on track, we need to remove 285 million tons by 2030. To hit those targets, we need a compound growth rate of 50% every year. That's faster than the growth rate of computers. To date, 135 startup companies have graduated from Airminer's Launchpad, and we need all of them and more to succeed to hit those milestones. But right now, we're not on track. This generation of startup companies isn't making it. They're dying because they're not getting the funding that they need. Some of our best tech is stalling out for months, sometimes raising funding, but usually not. And so here's what will happen if we don't take new action. We arrived to 2030 far below the milestone we need to hit. Policymakers, governments, other actors, people that care, move on. They choose other pathways instead. Because of that, the emerging greenhouse gas removal market collapses, investors disappear, and a generation of innovators go on to do something else. The planet continues to smash through temperature records year after year, and we arrive to 2050 with a destabilized climate and a destabilized civilization at war over food and water and land. To create a new future, we need to be bold, decisive, and courageous and take new actions today. We can create a future where a thousand greenhouse gas removal startups get $100,000 investments to pursue new possibilities. And there's a $5 billion follow-on fund to take the most successful ones and help them scale to pilot scale with all the support that they need to remove billions of tons of carbon dioxide. Let's call it Operation Scale Supply. In that world, we hit the 2030 target, and then we go on to hit the 10 billion tons removed every year by 2050. The climate is brought back into balance, and the world is transformed for the better. Let's make the difference in funding this generation of greenhouse gas removal startups so they can create this future. My question to you is, how can you contribute to Operation Scale Supply?